So in our next section, now we'll talk about the use of LAIs in clinical practice, specifically formulations of aripiprazole and olanzapine. So we'll begin talking about these two second-generation agent LAIs. We'll begin with aripiprazole monohydrate, also known as Abilify Maintena. The typical starting dose is 300 to 400 milligrams monthly given by deltoid or gluteal injection. Oral supplementation should be continued for 14 days. And the typical maintenance dose is essentially the same as the starting dose, 300 milligrams to 400 milligrams every three to four weeks. In terms of dose equivalency, 10 milligrams of oral aripiprazole corresponds to approximately 300 milligrams of LAI every month. And doses at or above 15 milligrams a day of oral aripiprazole would correspond to an LAI dose of 400 milligrams per month. If there is a delay or a missed dose that exceeds five to six weeks, patients should be reinitiated on aripiprazole LAI and also given two weeks of oral supplementation. Our next formulation is aripiprazole Laroxol or Aristata. The typical starting dose for Aristata is 441, 662, or 882 milligrams monthly. Oral supplementation should be continued for 21 days after the first injection. And typical maintenance doses for aripiprazole laroxol are either 441 to 882 milligrams monthly, 882 milligrams every six weeks, or 1,064 milligrams every two months. So what does dose equivalence look like here for aripiprazole laroxol? 10 milligrams oral aripiprazole corresponds to 440 milligrams LAI monthly. 15 milligrams of oral corresponds to either 662 milligrams per month, 882 milligrams every six weeks, or 1,064 milligrams every two months. And doses at or above 20 milligrams per day oral aripiprazole would correspond to 882 milligrams per month. It's important to note that the 441 milligram dose of aripiprazole laroxol may be administered either by deltoid or gluteal injection. All other doses are given by gluteal injection. If a patient has a delayed or missed dose that lasts greater than 12 weeks, again, the patient should be reloaded and given one week of oral aripiprazole supplementation. We also want to talk now about Aristata Initio. Initio is a single dose to either initiate Aristata or reinitiate Aristata following a missed dose. So this is given as Initio 675 milligrams as a one-time dose by deltoid or gluteal injection and a single dose of 30 milligrams oral aripiprazole. The first injection of Aristata may be administered on the same day as Initio or up to 10 days thereafter. And finally, in this section, we have olanzapine pomoate or Zyprexa Relprev. The typical starting doses range from 150 to 405 milligrams every two to four weeks given by gluteal injection. Oral supplementation should be continued for 14 to 21 days after the first injection. And typical maintenance doses are 150 to 300 milligrams every two weeks or 300 to 405 milligrams monthly. What does dose equivalence look like for olanzapine pomoate? 10 milligrams oral olanzapine corresponds to either 150 milligrams every two weeks or 300 milligrams every four weeks of the LAI. 15 milligrams oral olanzapine corresponds to either 210 milligrams every two weeks or 405 milligrams every four weeks. 
and doses at or above 20 milligrams a day would correspond to an LAI dose of 300 milligrams every two weeks. An important comment for olanzapine pomoate is that patients must be monitored for three hours post-injection, and this is a specific requirement for this medication. So our key points for this section, for Abilify Maintena, the typical starting dose is 300 to 400 milligrams per month. Oral supplementation is continued for 14 days, and the typical maintenance dose is 300 to 400 milligrams every three to four weeks. For Abilify Aristata, the typical starting dose is 441, 662, or 882 milligrams monthly. Oral supplementation is continued for 21 days. And the typical maintenance dose ranges from 441 to 882 milligrams per month, 882 milligrams every six weeks, or 1,064 milligrams every two months. For Zyprexa Relprev, the starting dose is 150, 210, 300, or 405 milligrams every two to four weeks, given by gluteal injection. Oral supplementation is continued for 14 to 21 days, and the typical maintenance dose is 150 to 300 milligrams every two weeks, or 300 to 405 milligrams monthly.